Ooh, moving forward, ain't no looking back. Yeah, them blessings raining down, and I want all of that. Yeah, we made it out the jungle, just know that it was a struggle. Now the whole team had to hustle, now see where we at. Ooh, moving forward, ain't no looking back. Yeah, moving forward, ain't no looking back. Ooh, moving forward, ain't no looking back. Yeah, we made it out the jungle, now see where we at. So the one thing that I actually went to Trader Joe's for, they don't have. Like the one thing, the main thing, even though I've got a bunch of things. Uh, but I'm looking for tahini sauce because I'm making homemade hummus today. And I, it's like one of the main things, like I, I need it for it. So since Trader Joe's doesn't have any, I'm going to stop by Walmart and see. I mean, they should have some tahini sauce, but I just... I like the Trader Joe's version, you know, because I'm a Trader Joe's girl. Uh, but it's fine. Let's go to Walmart and see. They better have some freaking tahini sauce because I'm making my lamb and hummus. You know what I'm saying? Okay, I'm home. Walmart did have tahini. Thank goodness. Thank goodness. But um, I never used this, so I hope it's good. And I barely saw it. Like, it was, like, at this one random shelf all the way at the bottom in the doggone eye. Like, I could have totally missed it and still not had some tahini and been very upset because I've been soaking these garbanzo beans all freaking night, ready to make my hummus today. So it would have been really upset if I didn't find any tahini. So we found tahini. Also, look at what Trader Joe's had. Aren't these so cute? They're little pumpkin hot cocoa melts. It says they're Mexican hot cocoa melts with white chocolate and cinnamon. I love it. I also grabbed some chili and lime chips. Um, if you guys don't know, I am like pretty much, I've cut out food dyes for most of my diet. So these are like the best chips that I can get for that spicy kick, you know what I'm saying? I also have some lamb, doesn't look very good right now, but it's been marinating all night with all those flavors in the fridge so we're gonna go ahead make homemade hummus so bomb and some lamb loin chops very excited for tonight's dinner let's do it looking to my left all my girls they go savage hey we don't play now you were at the top made me feel like a bottom couldn't keep it up that's a personal problem babe it ain't on me the only thing you're taking for a ride is your ego spending every night faking hot in the pillow almost had me thinking you're the best i could get how could i forget tell me how could i forget they'll watch me walk in your jaw drop me my dress drop me i still We're at the gym parking lot. I'm getting ready to go in. I'm doing my girl. I need to get my nails done. Like this is so bad. Anyways, I am going to do my dance class and it's about an hour long. Sometimes like, I don't know if you guys ever feel this way, but when you go to the gym, like there's times where obviously I'm just like, I just don't want to do this. I don't want to go. I don't want to do this. But then there's times where I'm like, I'm just so ready. Like I'm getting pumped. So I'm quite excited today. Actually, I'm feeling, I'm feeling the good energy. I'm ready to get down and um, have fun tonight. And then I'm going to go to Sprouts after because uh, I was trying to think of what to make for dinner. And I, oh, dang, I forgot, do I have enough chicken now? Do I have to go to Costco too? I don't know. We'll, we'll figure it out because I don't want to do too much. I'm kind of tired today, but I found this like jalapeno chicken recipe that was like quick and easy that I wanted to make for dinner tonight. But now I'm like, dang, I don't know if I got enough chicken thawed out in the fridge. I think I only have one piece of chicken. All right, just got done. Feel great. feel a little tired, but I feel great. One thing that always like, it's so weird, but one thing that like when I'm just like dying and I'm like over it, like something that I tell myself is like I'm really blessed to be alive and to have legs and a body <laughs> to like move with so I'm gonna like try my best and do my absolute best with what I got but I know some days like when I'm just like not feeling it like that's okay too like 
I can't be 100% every day. Like, who's like that? Come on. But anyways. Honestly, I don't feel like doing anything other than taking a bubble bath. Like, I've not taken a bubble bath in a really long time. And I just want to go home, enjoy my fall decorations tonight, take a bubble bath. That just sounds like a vibe. I can't believe I'm going to Sprouts and Trader Joe's in the same video. Like, I'm sorry guys, but these are my spots. So anyways, I found these sodas for 99 cents that I really wanted to try because they were on sale. And then I found chicken on sale. That was thawed. So I was like, perfect. It'll be good for my chicken tonight. And then I also found the Khalifa Oat Barista Blend whatever milk on sale too. So I was excited about that. But then when I went home to make my chicken, I realized these aren't chicken thighs. These are chicken drum sticks. I, I don't know how I made this mistake. I guess I didn't read it all the way through. And I personally have never cooked chicken drumsticks before. But I was so hungry that I was like, I don't care. We're just gonna wing it and try it out. So I found this random like marinade on TikTok and just started making it. And then I just threw the wings in the air fryer as you're gonna see here because your girl was hungry. So this is my first time ever making chicken drumsticks because that's all we had to work with but I think it turned out pretty well. very very important day because today is national coffee day and we love celebrating holidays like this <laughs> like, <laughs> I'm just kidding. it's just another day it's every day person's like today is national dog day national it's day, i'm national telling you they just make this stuff blah, blah, up day. like it's it's National Girlfriend Day like eight times a year. <laughs> it's it's not. National Coffee Day three times a year. Like I'm sick of it. No. <laughs> I gotta put an end to this. The most important one is National Coffee Day. Um, and the thing is, most places when they do this, they don't actually. The only thing they give out is free black coffee, like a brewed coffee. As we all know, I don't drink black coffee. I need my lattes my my stuff but um we're gonna go to a spot called grouchy john's or joe's john's. Okay. grouchy john's um it's a local um vegas coffee spot that we've been going to and i really really like their coffee and person doesn't drink coffee but he does drink their smoothies <laughs> Uh, they have very good smoothies. I don't I mean, know. I have to fill in the blank for that. Because <laughs> like, it was your drink. You couldn't have just said smoothie. <laughs> I get my coffee. Preston will get his smoothie. And we're also stopping my Target really quickly. Why are we going to Target? Because you insisted. But I don't know why specifically. You said... Uh, I don't remember. That you needed... Coffee day. I'm also posting a story right now on my Instagram stories. So <laughs> it's gonna be there right now if you go watch it. Um, but thank you guys for watching this video. And I'm not gonna lie, I was a little bit like, is this video really boring? Because I feel like I'm not doing much. So I very much apologize. I feel like sometimes I really struggle with like I don't know if this like video is entertaining at all. Like I'm literally going to Sprouts and Trader Joe's all day long and cooking. And that makes me happy and getting coffee. Um, but I'm about to watch the Miss USA pageant. Um, it's live tonight on cable television for the first time in like super duper long. I love watching pageants. Like they're so fun to me when I was younger. I did compete. Oh, Adrian Baylon is uh, hosting from the Cheetah Girls. Okay, girl. But I competed for Miss Teen Houston um, when I was younger. I never won anything, um, but 
I did compete. It was fun. It was a fun experience. But yeah, anyways, I'll let you guys go. I love you guys, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!